Alright guys, first thing you want to do is take the end off. There's usually screws at the ends. Alright, once you get that off, you're going to get something that looks like that. Your brushes should still be in there in the middle. There. Alright, first thing you want to do is strip the ends of your wire that you're going to use. I don't have any red wire, so I'm just going to use two black pieces. Alright, now you're going to want to get some flux on those wires. I just dab a little on there. there. Now, get your solder. And tin them. Make sure your end is tin first. That's it, that's all you need. Do the same for the other one. That's it. Alright, now you're gonna wanna tin your end belt. Uh, stab some flux on your finger. Dab it on there. Both sides. Take your iron and put your iron on the tab first and put the solder on. That's it. Now, once you get those tin, wipe them off. Once you got those wiped off, take your wire. Just Set the wire on top of the tab, push on top with your iron. Hold it still until you see the heart the solder. Alright, and just a little FYI. Doesn't matter what side the wires are on. If the motor runs backwards, go to your uh your radio, find the throttle position the throttle uh there's like a little tab on top if you have a uh, like a Traxxas TQ radio. Just flip it over to the side and then it'll run forward. Harden. Do the same for the other one. That's it. Wire on your motor. That easy. Don't forget flux. Flux is good. All you have to do now is put it on the motor and solder it on your speaker controller. 